Hello everybody, this is Status Foo of Gaming Starts Here. And this is RJ Snacks. We're playing some Battletoads today. Battletoads, and I'd also like to thank you for our 10 hits that we had. On Shaq Fu. On Shaq Fu. 10 hits for the week. We hit our goal. Yes. This one, we're going for 11 hits. So if you can help us get to 11 hits, uh, that would really help out. Today uh. we're playing Battletoads and Battle Mania. The yellow guy is Pimple. That's me. And, and I'm Rosh. I think that's his name. Rash. 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 It's okay. Rash. Rash. I, We're so used to looking at Japanese names. That yeah. We should just call him Rosh from now on. Rosh. He's Rosh. <laughs> we accidentally, um, if you saw earlier in the video, we picked uh, two-player A mode, which one mode you get to hit each other, the other mode you don't. I forgot which was which, and as you saw, he just kicked me in the face, so we picked the mode where we can hit each other. Basically making <laughs> this, this impossible. game absolutely impossible to finish the even the first level, because as you can see, I just knocked him in Pimple. the face. Yes. His name is Pimple. It's not hard. There's Pimple, Rash. The point of the game, we're Pimple and Rash. We have to save our friend Zit. If you ever played Battletoads, those are the three Battletoads. Pimple, almost, Rash, and Zit. Yes. I almost just died there. I fell down a hole. <laughs> and we have to save this other girl who was kidnapped by the evil queen. Um, we have to fight some pigs along the way. He keeps kicking me in the face. Oh, there we go. Sweet chin music. I, it, was, it was it was perfectly lined up, by the yeah. way. I'm going to have to sneeze in a second, so I apologize for that ahead of time. Yeah. Um, <laughs> this game, it's kind of cool. You get your basic attacks. You can do a uh, forward-forward attack, which does for Rash. Um, does a giant football kick. Or whatever, uh, spike kick, I should say. Spike, yeah. It's like the spiked cleats to the face. Yeah. Mine does a big horn ram attack. You can also do, while they're on the ground, he does a little ball and chain right there. I do a big work boot. It looks like a Timberland boot or something like that. I didn't tell PJ ahead of time that if you just stay at the tree and run forward, it'll keep aiming in front of you so the fireballs won't hit you. Um, so he, he just runs around and gets hit by a few of them. It's okay. He's cool. He survived. It, it also didn't occur to me in the after the first few fireballs fell that I could just stand there for a second and then move when I see the shadow. Yeah. No. Instead, I just kept moving and kept getting oh, hit. Oh, there you go. PJ kicked me in the Kicked face him and, and took his me. life. Yes. Luckily, yeah. I have three because everyone knows toads have three lives. Yes. They're half of what cats have. Because mm, they're lesser. Oh, my God. Oh, there he and goes. And then I just fell off. So there you go. Two lives within a minute. Yeah. Blue. Oh, oh. And there's the third one. Oh, wow. <laughs> I have zero lives already. This is like halfway through the first stage. We're doing great. <laughs> this is an awesome game. Oh, there. I Honestly, give him a nice little swift to the kick to the face again. If we picked... Uh, the B mode, I think this would have went much better, but um, I think this is more entertaining. We're trying, now I think we're trying a little bit harder not to kill each other. There you go, there's the, the cleat to the face. Those black <laughs> pigs are really tough. That sounds racist, but yeah. um, they last forever. If you don't finish them off, the, the double forward forward attack on the ground is an instant kill. If you don't do that to the black pigs, they stay there forever. And um, to avoid being hit and killed by PJ again, I stayed up on top for a little bit. <laughs> Just let me boot. do the dirty work for a little while. Yeah, I figured he could handle three pigs. He's yes. a toad. He's a battle toad, after all. Yep. And then <laughs> I, I just sent another kick to the face coming up soon. Yeah. Oh! oh! There's the headbutt to the face coming up soon. I always had fun with battle toad games. I played a few for Nintendo. They had the regular battle toads and then the double dragon battle toads. And uh, PJ did decide to move forward there. I played. Battletoads, Double Dragon, more than any of the other ones. Yeah, I think everyone did. The regular. Oh, there goes PJ off the ledge. <laughs> that was not my fault. He said it was at first, but I did not hit PJ. He fell off on his own. Yes. Now we go through another little fireball thing here. Again, I run forward and he uh, he dodges a little. He does better this time than last time. Much better actually. Yep, I'm just doing a little back and forth moving here. I decided to mix things up a little bit. Staying out of the fire. <laughs> too bad that doesn't last for too long. Yeah, then, then, uh. Oh, he just fell off. He fell off twice. <laughs> right there, he had two lives, fell off once, came back, fell off immediately after. <laughs> so, there goes one of our continues. You share continues. Um, so there goes one of ours right there. But the really funny part is coming up in a second because stupid me, instead of uh, instead of jumping, I punch and fall off the edge and use our second continue. <laughs> so within a matter of a minute, we used our two continues. I think we get one more. We're doing great, by yes. the way. Yes, we're... We lost all of our score. 
We're on near the end of the first stage, and we have one continue left. Yep, we got this. Piece of cake. PJ's kicking me in the face. Don't kick the three skeleton guys with shields. No, kick me, please. <laughs> so it's okay. It's yeah, so now we gotta go through this all over again. Lots of fun. Oh my god. Yeah, so uh, just more of the uh, fire dodging again. I almost died, I think. I might survive, who knows. Probably the most exciting part of this game, which will not be in this video, is the part where you're driving, the, you're on the, <laughs> the bike you thing. You just fell down again. Yeah, the, I third, did. the third level here is a racing map, and you just have to uh, not die, which yeah. is hard, because they, they have blinking walls that show you where the walls are going to pop up, but at the end, they just come so fast, you have to memorize it. That's the only way to do it. They were, um, yeah, I used to get so frustrated at that stage. And, um, oh, you actually played this before? Not this one. Oh, okay. They had that in the other ones? Double Dragon. Oh, the one, I used to play the one for Game Boy a lot. There's one for Game Boy? Yep. I never had a Game Boy, so I was a deprived child. The, uh, the one for Game Boy I used to play a lot, and he used to have one of the driving stages, and that was by far the hardest part of the game. Yeah. Uh, even though this game is ridiculous, I've never made it past, like, the fourth stage. I don't even know if I made it past the driving stage. I had a few friends that did, but not me. I was never a good battle toter. This one, this boss here, the giant stone pig, it's cool because every time you hit him, you get a finishing move. So I get the giant fist in the air, I get the uh, ram ram horns, and uh, and the giant boot. Yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory what he's doing. Easy to uh, avoid. Pretty like much. Avoiding the even fires. Though, even though PJ just got squished right there. Yeah. It's I... cool. Yeah, it's easy to avoid. <laughs> Squish. <laughs> Yeah, I got a that little statue of the uh, the sexy witch in the background. I think that's the main villain. Oh, there she is! Look at that. I always look at her and I think of uh, what's her face, Elvira. That, that I I thought of the girl from Roger Rabbit with just black hair. Hmm. Yeah, I see it now. That's pretty cool. So by some miracle, we actually made it to the second stage without using up all our continues. Yeah, well, we only have one left, so I mean... Hey, we didn't use all of them, and that's what counts. It's effort. How many stages are in this game anyway? I've never made it past stage three. <laughs> that's, why we're, that's why we're playing this video straight through. Because we're not going to get too far anyways. But um, this stage is uh, very slow, <laughs> to say the least. Um, this one and the next one, it's kind of annoying. There's actually not a lot of fighting. As it, you can see, there's a lot of spikes. There's a lot of spikes. It's mo mainly avoiding traps. And PJ made it through. Look at that. One. And up. <laughs> oh, no. Accidentally, well, accidentally on purpose, killed PJ. I kind of forgot I could hit him. But um, that's okay. This game is, is difficult. I can't do it. I know that. Yeah, and uh, I never really played this one. I played the other ones, and yeah, they're all, all pretty difficult games. Give it a shot. I say the older games are much harder than the newer ones. So if you like a challenge, go for it. Give Battletoads a shot. And uh, we will see you next time when we review, uh, I think we're doing Roller Coaster Tycoon. Yeah, Roller, to uh, <laughs> roller Toasters. Okay. <laughs> roller Toasters. On that note, we'll see you next time. If only you could see what I see right now, you would be blind. <laughs> <laughs>